we're gonna do a chronograph test today. All these flat bands are all different types of rubber or all different all different brands. They're all cut at seven uh, and a half inches long. The taper is three quarter inch to half inch taper on each one. This one down here is 30 latex. This one is 132nd gum rubber. This one is uh, Simple Shots Black. This one is 40 latex. This one is the GZK Natural Latex. This one is the GZK Black Latex. Most everybody knows this one is Theraband Gold. This one is another type of latex from China. Not sure what it's called, but it's a Chinese flat band. And this one is just, you can buy this at Walmart. It's just a Gold Gym workout band. That one right there. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine different bands we're going to test. My chronograph is a uh, it's stuck on meters per second. I can't do feet per second on my chronograph. So here's a little example. 80, 80 meters per second is 262 feet per second. 75 meters per second is 246. 70 meters per second is 229. Just to kind of give a baseline of where we're at. So I'm gonna take each slingshot and shoot it three times through the chronograph and three, get three good readings and then write an average down for each one. My first shot is gonna be at the can down there. Shoot the can just to warm it up. And then uh, we'll shoot the chronograph. And that's, my draw length is right here every time. That's, that's what my draw is gonna be. It's about 40 or 42 inches. More in there. All right, let's get our chronograph set up. And the first one's going to be 30 latex. Ammunition is 3 8 ammo. And let's see how we do. All right, that's 75 meters per second, which is 246 feet per second. 76. Can you see it? Mm -hmm. And 77. So 30 latex here. 75, 76, 77. All right, the next one is 130 seconds gum rubber. Just pure gum rubber. Well, first shot will be at the can to kind of warm it up. A little stiff, gotta hit the can. All right, this one's a little shorter. It's not shorter, just a little harder to pull. Pretty stiff, but that's gum rubber. So let's see how we do over the chronograph with gum rubber. Dad, it says error on it. You gotta press it. It should go through anyway. It should? Yeah. All right, 78. You see it? Mm hmm 77. 79. All right, gum rubber. 77, 78, 79. All right, the next one is the Simple Shots Black Latex. I'm 
shooting all every every one I'm shooting OTT to try to get some kind of similar baseline. Shoot the can first. Just to warm it up. And then we'll go over the chronograph. 76. Seventy seven, seventy eight, seventy six, seventy seven, seventy eight. So we're going to be somewhere between two forty six and two sixty two on that one. So this one is forty latex. They don't make this anymore. I just happen to have a bunch of it that I ordered when it was going out. You can see where there's bad defects as a hole in it. I still should be able to get by and shoot this. Shoot the can first. All right, then we'll go over the crony with 40 latex. 85. No reading on that one. 82. I'm trying to maintain the same draw length each time. 83. So 85, 82, 83 on the 40 latex, 40 latex. I guess that would help to put that there. That's a simple shot, simple black. And this is gum rubber. And this is 30 latex. All right, now we're on the GZK. Same taper, same length, everything's the same. Put a shot on the can first, get warmed up. Seventy-five. Seventy six, seventy five, seventy five, seventy six, seventy five, and this is G Z K. All right, this is the G Z K black. Is this stuff right here. Sent that over to try. GZK Black, same taper, same everything. Get a shot at the can first. Kind of warm it up. Now we're going over the uh, chronograph. Hit the chronograph, don't hit the chronograph. That's a no-no. 82. 83. 77. No reading that time. 75. 
74, black, G, Z, K. All right, now, Theraband Gold, probably the most well-known around the world. All right, shoot the can first. All right, now over the chronograph. 77. Seventy-eight. Seventy-nine. Gold. This is a little thinner. But it's about the same stuff. Seems pretty snappy. Don't know what to call this. I just know it came from China. On one of the slingshots I ordered. Let's see if we can shoot the can first. All right. Seventy-two. Can you see the numbers, Ted? Yes. Bad reading. Seventy-four. Seventy-two. 72, 74, 72, Chinese, green, I don't know what, where it came from. All right, now this is the last one we're going to try. It is simply gold gym fans, you can buy this at Walmart. Start with a can. Warmed up band. It's about it's about 85 degrees out today, so these bands sitting in the sun, they should be at their highest performance level. Like I said, my draw length is right here, which is around 42, somewhere in there. Seventy five, seventy four, seventy three, seventy five, seventy four, seventy three. Okay, well, let's look at let's look at what we've got. Our fastest was 40 latex by quite a bit. The second fastest was gold. And then it looks like simple shot black, GZK, 30 latex, black GZK. We're all about the same. The slowest was this Chinese green, and I, this is pretty close to the same as well. The only thing, the only one that really stood out speed-wise was 40 latex. Everything else is the same, basically, relatively the same. Now, obviously, just for example purposes, if you want to take any slingshot and make it faster, just shoot faster and use your wrist. For example, this is the gum rubber, just gum rubber. 